We're in Windows Server 2012. I'm going to show you how to change the IP address on a virtual machine so it can connect out to the internet. So if you'll notice that if we try to ping any public IP address, we'll get an error here saying that the transmission failed. So we want to make sure that uh, we add a static IP address in this particular case because we don't have DHCP enabled. So we're going to go into Hyper-V Manager and we're going to right click and choose settings and in Hyper-V Manager we click on the network adapter and we want to make sure that we have an adapter that shows up and if you want you can enable the virtual LAN identification so if this says virtual adapter and it's blank then you're going to want to go into the virtual switch manager and make sure that you add an external virtual switch once you create it and it should look like this all right so now that we've got that let's just go ahead and go back into our Hyper-V and we'll click on change adapter settings we see our network card has shown up and we double click on TCP IP version 4 if that's what we're using and we'll click on use the following IP address now the IP address that you choose is going to uh, be based on the subnet that you're currently using and if you're not sure just go to your host computer and type IP config and you'll see the subnet you're using so in this case we're 120 uh, 192.168.21 so you want to pick an IP address that's free that's that's not already been assigned to another computer and in this case we are picking 17 and we're going to pick a DNS server that we know is available internally on Active Directory. And if we want, we can allow it to find PCs and devices. We do want that, so we'll go ahead and click Yes. We're not in a public network, we're in a private network. Now let's go back to our command prompt and try to ping again, and now we can get out to the Internet.